world, what's the deal? It's your boy Original back with another one for y'all, man. I checked this out today on my channel. We going over the Street Yantra, how to properly meditate on the Street Yantra. Go ahead, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Turn on post notifications if you want to see this run to 100,000 we about to do on Yon World this year. Now, today on my channel, we going over the Street Yantra. Now, I was inspired by the Street Yantra, man. I've been inspired for years, ever since this symbol came to me through a dream. You know what I'm saying? I'm from Detroit. I ain't know nothing about Hinduism, none of that. And, you know, six years ago, this symbol came to me through a dream. And ever since then, I've been hooked, just meditating on it. And it changed my life, man. It really changed my life. And it's protected me and it's continued to bless me. And, you know, now I'm in a position right where in order to go to the next level, I got to give all this information out. You know, no matter who receive it, you know, it's real. You know, I don't care what y'all saying. Like, it's real. You know, no matter who received this information. But if you really researching the street yantra and you want to know, you know, is the power to work? Like, if you really felt, yes. Like, like, just short and simple, you know, meditating on street yantra really can change your life. But I'm about to teach y'all exactly what I did, exactly how I meditate on the street yantra. Now, First thing first, when you want to meditate on the Street Yantra, you need a correct version of the Street Yantra. I recommend getting this version I'm gonna have up on the screen. Uh, you can go to my website in the description and download this image. But this is the correct version of the Street Yantra. This in all the right proportions, you know, everything is in harmonic resonance with the universe. Now, the Street Yantra is a very ancient symbol. And we're going to go over that more. I made more videos about that, but I just want to stay on top and just let y'all know exactly how to meditate on this symbol. Now, when you meditate on the Street Yantra, the goal is to maintain the image. The goal is to remember the image of the Street Yantra. That's the main goal. The goal is to give it attention. You have to give it attention and activate it, you know, because the Street Yantra, you're going to learn this when you start meditating on it. The Street Yantra is a cosmic energy generator. It literally generate life force energy. If you don't believe this, test it. Like, look at the Street Yantra for one minute, like exactly 60 seconds without breaking your focus. Look exactly in the center and you will be able to carry a light image of it. Now, this is energy, like it's, it's literally energy from the Street Yantra. Like, you could do this with any other object, you know, in the 3D world, stare at it for, you know, a minute and you're not able to carry the full image. Like, you will literally be able to carry every triangle and the more you try to do this the more you remember the image of the street yantra the more it'll activate in your mind it activate in a section of your mind called the pineal gland you know it's this ancient area you know that also holds the third eye but it creates stuff like dmt that can give you information and insight on you know your life and your goals and you know how to go about life you know and it's deep so when you meditate on the Street Yantra, you have to look at the center bindu point, I recommend for nine minutes straight. You could test it. If you look at the Street Yantra for one minute, you will be able to maintain the image. You'll be able to hold the image and you can always test the Street Yantra. I recommend doing what's called a white wall test. It's when you look at this image of the Street Yantra, I recommend getting the black. You can get the Street Yantra with the colors and everything, but to really test it, look at the black and white version and you're going to capture a bluish green image when you look at a white wall it's going to be a bluish green image of the street yantra and that's how you know it's transferring energy into your body and once you give it praise once you go to the street yantra this this is a sacred geometry structure every pyramid on earth like you know when you see the pyramids one thing about pyramids is they never have any text in pyramids. It's never any text. You know why it's never like holographics and shit? They might have a stone outside tell you what this is, but they never have text inside the pyramids. It's because every pyramid on earth, whether it's in Mexico, whether it's in Brazil, whether it's in Africa, whether it's in India, you know what I'm saying? Whether it's in Southeast Asia, every pyramid on earth is designed to generate energy. And the pyramids are always near water. If the pyramid is not near water, they'll create a fake, you know what I'm saying? Uh, they'll create a man-made lake to, you know, generate water to this pyramid because every pyramid is made of energy. And when you look at the pyramid from a bird's eye view, it's actually the street yantra. 
you know? And I got videos on this. Like, you could go check out my video I made about this. But that's why this symbol is so powerful to meditate on. You know, I recommend staring at the center for nine minutes straight and go to it with your desire. Like, whatever you want to create. Literally, it'll bless you. It'll protect you. It's a it's an input output thing. Like once you once you give it attention and you go to it with the thoughts and the life and whatever you want to create, you gotta have the image of what you want to create or what you see yourself with. Whether that's a new job, a new car, you know, success in your business, you know, a new partner, like whatever you see in your mind, like you have to go and think about that while staring at the street entry for nine minutes. You have to like visualize what you want while getting the the cosmic energy from the street entry because it's a it's literally an energy generator like believe what you want like it worked for me and it works for plenty of other people like if you look up any of the Lakshmi or the street yantra mantras it's 16 million 17 million views like I'm not the only one that know about this I'm probably I'm not the only one talking about this either, but it's people that know about this and people that use this all the time. And the Sri Yantra is the most sacred Yantra. And the word Yantra literally means machine. So this is a manifestation machine. This is a tool to help you, you know, unlock energy that's already stored within you. That we connected around, you know what I'm saying? It's electrons around us and shit we, around us that we can use and pull, nigga. And you can pull all this shit together by the Sri Yantra. I'm gonna have a video at the end. I'm gonna have a. I'm gonna have to put like an animation at the end of this video just to let y'all know how to properly meditate on the Sri Yantra. But just to give you one more rundown of it, to properly meditate on the Sri Yantra, first get the correct version of the Sri Yantra. Download the correct version of the Sri Yantra. It's on my website. Next, you want to stare in the center bindu point. Remember, the goal is to main to remember the image of the Sri Yantra, just to focus to get the image of the Sri Yantra in your mind. You know, it's it'll already activate in your mind. You can test it one minute. Look at it for one minute, look at a white wall, you'll be able to capture the image of it. Now, the next thing you want to do once you once you're looking at it, you want to stare at it for nine minutes. You want to stare at it for nine minutes, do as much as you can. It can be intense at first, but remember, the Sri Yantra is an appealing figure. Like, it's appealing to the eye. You're, it's naturally appealing because it's in harmonic resonance. All the golden ratios, the pi, everything, you know, it's in harmonic resonance, you know, with the universe. It is naturally appealing to the eye. So over time, it'll be easier for you to maintain focus on the Sri Yantra once you look at it for a long time. You know, and... You want to go to whatever whatever you want to create. Whatever you want to create. When you in that thought tank, when you in that mind, and you thinking about that shit, you know what I'm saying? Instead of staring off into space or looking on your phone, stare at the street yantra. You know what I'm saying? Stare at this symbol, and it'll work for you. I'm telling you, it will. I'm telling you, it will. I recommend it, you know? And like I said, you could go back on my channel. Like I've been using it for six years. I, it was literally in the basement. I was literally in a basement, you know, didn't have nothing. And it's helped me, it's just blessed me with shit working out. You know, shit just growing when I didn't expect it to grow like that. You know, shit, shit getting more money than I, you know, thought I was gonna get. You know what I'm saying? It's just, it's just things like that. I kept moving, I kept, you know, expanding my mind, following my intuition and it make it more sharp. It, it build that connection more, you know. So I'm just talking from experience, but try it out for yourself. Try it out for yourself. Don't just go off everything I'm saying. Look at the street yantra. If you if you look at the street yantra and you're not able to hold the image of it, then you know everything I said will lie. You know what I'm saying? But I I don't, you could be 60. You could be 60 right now. You could be 13 years old. I don't I don't know how old y'all. You could be 18 years old. You know what I'm saying? You look at this image for one minute and look at a white wall, you gonna maintain the image. And that's showing you, this is a light body image. And once you get that in your light, you know, this world reacts with light. You know what I'm saying? Once you get that in your light, your energetic body, it's a wrap. It's, it becomes your Merkabah, it becomes your protector. So I'm about to play this animation clip for y'all. Make sure y'all like this clip. It's your boy, I'm out, peace. I am Cherie Yantra. 
and I was created by Lord Brahma at the time of the creation of the world. I was created for the benefit of humanity. Goddess Malakshim made me powerful by blessing me with her power. I am a simple machine that works on a simple principle of input and output. You have to provide some input of raw material, and as output, I will create wealth for you. You must be thinking, what's my input of raw material? It's very simple. You have to give Dan to your Ishta Devita. A small act of generosity by you in the form of Dan can result in huge wealth accumulation. So to get the best result, you have to give Dan to your Ishta Devita, by which I will create wealth for you.